Um, so we've got cruise control already set up. The Max ECU is controlling the cruise control, no problem at all with the buttons on the steering wheel. Um, but I kind of thought this is quite cool. Um, so if we press and hold the cancel button, watch the speed, lots of taco. So it goes up to three and then drops down after a little while, three seconds. And then it puts us straight up into the next drive mode. So we are now in, oh, where are we? We're now in sport. Um, and if I flick that again, it then goes up to four, which then puts us into track mode. It waits a minute and then goes back down. And then if we're really feeling brave, we can go all the way up and go into drag mode. Um, now, what I find interesting and really clever about this is, yes, we can adjust the modes on the gearbox, but I've also um, modified the way that the throttle behaves. So when we're in, when we go up through these various um, different modes, um, we go up through in the same in the same method the way that the throttle behavior is so low end normal street mode it's just going to behave nicely uh, and then you know behave like a normal car would and then the further up we go the you know the the more peppy the pedal gets uh the same interestingly with traction i've got the different traction methods set up for different levels so yeah it's it's how flexible the ECU can be. I think this is pretty cool um, because we reverse engineered the whole canvas on the vehicle. Um, it behaves as the original vehicle should. We can, you know, we can make all of this do whatever we want. Interestingly, I've got like uh, these gauges here are controlled as well. So on the XKR, I, I can press and hold the button on the back or wherever we set uh, and that behaves like a boost gauge.